hello everyone this is Imran Ali here welcome back to our channel and today we are going to talk about how you can accept your deposit payment on WooCommerce so as you can see we are at WooCommerce.com and uh, first of all we need to understand like what it does like what is deposit payments and partial payments we can also say that so first of all what does partial payment or deposit payment mean partial payment means a payment that is less than the full amount due in other terms like uh, it includes part payments installment payments down payment or upfront payments so what it does let's just take an example of a board like if you are going to buy a board online and uh, you are looking like it's around thirty thousand dollars and you want to buy that board but obviously you need to check out the engine and you need to inspect that board right so what you need to do you need to go ahead and uh you know pay down payment like uh, only five five hundred five thousand dollars and you go ahead and take your time and go ahead and check out that board for you for yourself and after that you will pay your other remaining amount so how you can do that you can apply that not only board you can apply that on e-commerce and all other things like when they receive their goods they can pay the remaining amount so in that way uh, your customer would be very like uh, you know they would be very trustworthy for you and uh, they will always try to buy something from you so how you can do that and what plugins we are going to use i will show you right now so first thing first you need to go add plugins add new and you will end up over here obviously search for uh obviously uh you know deposit and partial payment so i'm just gonna write that deposit and partial payments so as you can see it's over here and it uh, the developer of this plugins is uh, echo webs so remember to check this out right and click on install now it may take some time but not that much and now activate so once we activate it, activate it it would be enough and yes it has been activated so once you activate it you can see on the left side under the menu or uh, command menu you can see we have deposits click on deposits you will end up over here and obviously I used this uh, plugin before so that's why it's already open otherwise sometimes it would be like this and once you come in for the first time and you can see it it will show up like this so once you click on like you need to enable this first of all right click on this and after that you can just apply more configuration on your uh, add to cart or you know your all deposit payment configuration so how you can do that you can just allow only login customers to use that feature so you can also that restrict that to only login play uh, login customers after that you have your deposit type like what is percentage so how you are going to show them like as a percentage of fixed amount you can also do that deposit amount and uh, default section like pay deposit or pay full other order full fully paid status processing or completed disable payment gateways and you can also add that over here so after that just click on save changes it's very simple as you can see and if i go to my store right now you know and this is my store okay and uh, if i add something from over here i have already added to my art card something if i add this over my card and if i go to my card you can see i have my uh subtotal over here my total over here due today so i need to pay 80 dollar for now and the future payments would be 720 so why 80 dollars you can see on over here we have set that amount right 
10% over here you can see 10% deposit amount so I have said that right you can set that for yourself like whatever you want so right now you can see over here it has been shown like it's showing every single thing and if I click on proceed to checkout it will take you right over here to the billing area and here you can see on the right side you have your deposit amount over here your future amount over here also available just go ahead and select your payment amount and go to place order so this is how you are going to place uh, you know deposit and full payment uh, partial payment from this plugin so these are the options you can choose but if you are going to buy a pro version from over here as you can see on the right side we have more options like payment plans enable deposit on checkout a email notification force deposit on product page category deposit rules user role deposit rules user role deposit restrictions and there are many more so how you can do that and what are the pricing right just click on this and it will open up this page obviously it uh, the developers of this plugins are echo webs as i told you this before on the right side you have your subscriptions option over here like single site only one site uh, one year update would cost around 40 usd and single site lifetime update would cost around 80 usd i don't think it's that bad right for uh five sites you need to pay uh, ob obviously for only one year 90 usd and five sites for lifetime update 180 usd so it's a lot and obviously they are providing you providing you like 30 days money back guarantee so there's no worry about that and you can see over here you have your free version you can just try for the free version which we are using right now you can just check out the demo and all the things from over here so yeah this is how you are going to use uh, this plugin for your uh, you know deposit uh, accept deposit on your website and it's very easy way to do that you can see you just need to plug in use like install that plugin and after that just go ahead and use that percentage and that payment like sele selection default selection you just need to go ahead and select that and if you are going to choose your pro version you will have more options so thank you for watching this video i hope you understand every single thing if you do if you have any queries please comment down below let us know and thank you for watching this video bye bye